Welcome to another day at the Daily Echo. In this video, we will explain step by step the life cycle of bees, including their functions and whether they are queen bees, workers or drones. Let's get started. Egg laying. The bees start laying eggs in a cell of the hive. These eggs receive multiple attention from the community because a new bee hatches from each of them. Therefore, solitary bees have all their food stores in their cell, while social bees carry the needed food to their eggs. Larva. Only three days pass after egg laying before a larva hatches from them. Being arthropods, these larvae must molt to increase their size until they reach the desired size. At this stage, they reach the maximum larval size, which is between 5 and 6 centimeters. Despite this, the bee has no external legs or wings, as it performs no function or activity within the honeycomb and is limited only to feeding. It takes 4 to 5 days for the bees to cover their cell. That is, they open it. Pupa and metamorphosis. The larval develop into pupae, structures in which they are surrounded by immobile capsules. To complete the metamorphosis of the bees, a three-part structure with head, thorax and abdomen, as well as legs, wings and a stinger, in the case of a female bee, must emerge. This process takes between 10 and 23 days and during this time the bee does not eat. Adulthood Once metamorphosis is complete, the new adult breaks through the cuticle of the larva and is ready to begin its life. If the egg was not fertilized, a male is formed. But if it was fertilized, then a female is born. Before we continue, we will put you to the test. Of the 20,000 species of bees that exist, how many are capable of producing honey? 5 species, 10 species, 15 species. Think about it carefully, because at the end of the video you can check if you were right. What does the queen bee do? The queen bee is selected from the egg, while the other bees become workers. This depends on the feeding of the larvae, because the future queen receives pure jelly, an elixir produced by the worker bees. Two days after her metamorphosis, the queen bee undertakes exploratory flights. After seven days, she undertakes nuptial flights for four days, during which she is fertilized by 10 to 16 drones. After fertilization, she collects up to 5 million sperm cells in her spermotheca to produce eggs throughout her life. The queen bee is the only one that lays eggs and can lay about 2,000 eggs a day. She lays them directly into the cells, leaving space for the worker bees to supply the cells with food. Their lifespan is 2 to 5 years due to their diet of royal jelly. Her life ends when her ability to lay eggs decreases and a new queen takes her place. What do workers' bees do? All worker bees are female and divide their activities according to age. Before day 21st, they perform activities inside the hive, such as building hexagonal wall, wax cells, feeding larvae with bee bread and cleaning the hive producing royal jelly as nurses, storing food stores, defending the entrance to the comb, and ventilating. After the first 21 days, their wax glands atrophy from all the work, so they go outside to collect water, pollen, and plant nectar. They live actively only six weeks. What do the drones do? Their main function is to fertilize the queen so that she produces eggs and they die after fertilization because their reproductive system remains stored in the queen. So they are ready to fertilize between 12 and 24 days after they are born. Before they fertilize the queen, they can perform other activities, such as distributing honey to the other individuals in the hive. And going back to the question we asked you before, the correct answer is A. Of the 20,000 species of bees that exist, only 5 are capable of producing honey. 
tell us, did you know that bees go through all of these stages? Until next time, 